Welcome to Rise to the Equation. We're back with a math challenge that you've probably never seen before. To set the stage, suppose you were given the following seven letters. M, O, T, H, E, R, and E. We've all played the game where we need to unscramble the letters to form a word. If you're a Scrabble player, then you would salivate if you got letters like these because they can easily be rearranged to form a seven-letter word. Can you guess the word? You got it. Theorem. Okay, but this channel is called Rise to the Equation, not Rise to the Word. So we're going to play the exact same game, only using math formulas, of course. Let's do an example. You're given 2 times pi equals r times c. Can you rearrange the math symbols to create an actual formula? Of course, c equals 2 pi r, the formula for the circumference of a circle. Let's do one more warm-up before we get started. For this one, you're given 433 equals v times r over pi. It looks ridiculous at first, but keep the following rule in mind. None of the symbols from the original formula have changed. Only their positions have changed. Give this a shot before I show the solution. So you can see that it's actually just the formula for the volume of a sphere. Okay, let me just state a couple key points before we begin. First, remember the key rule for the game. None of the symbols are changed in any way, only their positions. Second, I'm only going to display formulas that you would learn in a math class, not chemistry, physics, or some other subject. Third, the formulas should all be familiar to a high school graduate. None of the formulas go beyond calculus. And finally, the formulas will start off easy and get progressively harder. There's going to be 20 in total, and the last few are truly challenging. All the solutions will be displayed at the end. Keep track of how many you get correct so you can determine your level. And to really challenge yourself, try to do this without pausing. Okay, that's it. Are you ready? Good luck and have fun.
come back no more.